Hello, welcome to another episode of New Gameplay. Today I'm your host, Jeff Cork, joined today by Leo Vader. Hey, man. Hey, man. Andrew Reiner. Why, hello. Why, hello. And Alex Stednick in the oh. booth. How's it going? Hello, friends. Hello. Good. What are we looking at here, Reiner? There will be blood. Mm. Right now. Blood Roots. <laughs> blood Roots. A new game from Paper Cult. Paper Cult. A Montreal studio. They made uh, a game called Fat Mask in 2017. I'll believe it. <laughs> and we're playing this on PS4 right now. Mm -hmm. And I really like this game. Okay. Was that a person in a grinder? What was happening there? Yeah, there's a lot of dead people right now. Huh. Oh. Yucky. That's cool. I'm hmm. playing. People end up in the strangest places. <laughs> yep. And I'm always. I was going to play, but I wanted Leo to. Yeah. Because a lot of this is about your first time playing it. Like, what makes it so interesting is. It kind of has a Tony Hawk style of combo system to it. Okay. Where you mm. want to be flawless. Oh, so that's why you got me. Exactly. I understand that. <laughs> because you're really good. Leo Maybe. shreds. I do indeed. Hmm. But part of that is discovering what you did right and wrong and how you interact with the world. Mm -hmm. and I am very fluid in that. I've already played all the way through it. So yeah. we will see Leo's successes and, <laughs> I hate to say it, bud, failures. Failures? <laughs> that's not Count our chickens before they hatch. Failure is just success on its head. So don't be <laughs> discouraged, Leo. <laughs> Failures are just a cool way to present success. Yeah. So that's Mr. Wolf. Your character. W O L F or W U L F? W O. Okay. Mm. Like the animal. Like the one on his head. Yes. Gotcha. Got it. You have a first name? Mr. Mm. <laughs> is Dr. Wolf his father? We could give him a canonical first name. Mm. Well, Paper Colt said we could. Oh, really? Dead guy. <laughs> Dead wolf. All right. Well, thanks for watching. Everybody. That's it. <laughs> Did I mess up? You blew it. Yeah. You shouldn't yeah, have picked up the axe like that. You could do a blood blot test or ink blot test. What do you see, Jeff? Uh, Rorschach's mask. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I probably ruined those tests. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it if you see like food in them, you're a serial killer? Uh -oh. I oh. saw a carrot. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that looks like a ketchup splot to me, so oh. I guess I'm a serial killer. <laughs> I like the style of this a lot so far. Yeah. yeah. I noticed music by Vibe Avenue. They did the music for Ultimate Chicken Horse, which is an exceptionally good soundtrack. So I cool. like a lot of this game, and, and you'll discover what I like about it very soon. It's very different in, in its flow. Hmm. You you replace that wolf head with a cub's hat. <laughs> you do you, you do get different hats. All right, uh, okay. that might just be an end game thing. Okay, but you are for various feats getting different ah, so things like big kills. Your head. That's cool. And the masks or the hats do mm -hmm. different things for you. So that is end game stuff. Hmm. Okay, so some kind of so, axe cooldown looks like. Yes. No. No. You only get limited number of uses. Oh, Wait a minute! We're, you didn't like that in Breath of the Wild, though. Oh! <laughs> Suddenly, oh, I love. There's this. a bit of Stockholm syndrome in playing uh -huh. this. <laughs> oh! So, right there, Leah learned you got to be flawless. Yeah. And quick. It's a one-hit death. Very nice. Huh. And that's everywhere. Why don't you go jump on that barrel? Jump on it. Oh! Oh, that's fun. Oh. Whoa! Whoa! Bam! That's excellent. Whoa. Oh, oh. okay. Nice combo. <laughs> this game Go, Leo. is pretty good. <laughs> and one of the things that's really great about it is you see all these different things he's using. Oh, Different enemies come into play, uh -huh. different scenarios. There's some platforming. But as the whole game goes on, you're learning new things over and over. Mm. So it's not the same thing again and again and again. I was just going to ask when you were going to set somebody on fire. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for answering. Uh, can you just do a melee attack you without can, an item? But it is such a small window. Right. Oh, you can pick up the barrels. Oh, and the wheel. Oh. <laughs> and there's a bit of room for improvisation. If you screw up and there's a guy running at you, you there might be something nearby that you can grab right away. <laughs> gotcha. So presumably if someone was good enough at this, they could go a whole level like under one combo. Yes. Cool. Have you done that? Oh, Ryan? I have, yeah. Does it feel just so good? Yeah. It does. Uh, to be oh. number one ranked in the world. What? 
<laughs> when did this game come out? Granted, there was only 10 people playing, uh, one of which was mm. Greg Miller. Uh, uh, <laughs> so you'll see his name guy. at the end of this level, I believe. Yeah. Unless he fell off the leaderboard. Oh, I see what happened. <laughs> I understand <laughs> what I've done. So, so I you can, don't like, have to keep the this? yes. God, you don't have good. to keep the combo going, but you want to, right? So there's like this replayability to this game where so there's one enemy left. You got to go find him. I see. Can you interact with that dog-like creature? Which no. one? On that roof. Up there. No, that's just a wolf watching you. So you mm. want to come okay. back this way? I think yeah, you missed one enemy. of the early enemies in the level. Go that way. Oh. And then there up we there. go. So you can oh, chop down those trees and create a path up. Oh. When you get this, that's the last enemy. Oh. Oh, okay. I see. Cool. I was going to ask if it was some sniper elite type of thing. But, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, that was my brother. A little, a little trophy action there, well, too. I never found that, so. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the trophy, Leo. No problem. Oh, that's do, cool. If you want to be friends with Reiner on PS4, his handle is guest1, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Now, how about throwing? Yes, do it. Throwing's it, one of the most useful things. Get down on the ground. Oh. What's that in the barn right there? Jump on that. Whoa. <laughs> wow. Okay. So you can just Come go grab me. that vase. Oh. Oof. What is that spiky arrow looking thing, too? Right Where? there. Is that a good? Yeah, what I'm going that? for it. So you're going to start learning things like the enemies. The we'll two see. that you just killed first, they're the weakest, right? Like, these guys are pretty easy to, yeah. to take down. The guy right there wearing the green shirt, he's a problem. So, yeah, you want to yeah, prioritize him, him a little bit. <laughs> so grab the spiky arrow thing Jeff was talking about. Yeah, what yeah. Is I there? didn't mean to ignore you, but oh, is there's a kind time of or place. Three shots with it. Oh. <laughs> but do it from afar. Okay. I can, and I will. So how's it feel, Leo? It feels really great. I see what you mean about Tony Hawk now. It's hard to picture at first, but like the the speed of coming back is just perfect. Yeah, it's immediate are the, and are the checkpoints always this generous? Like for a for the fight? levels get bigger. Yeah, considerably bigger. And there will be times where like good. Yeah, yeah. See this? So that pulls you into them. So every weapon or every thing you can interact with gives you a little different taste. Like that sword, you can line up three guys in a row. Yeah. And oh. just dart all the way through them, or even more sometimes. Oh, that's, that's awesome. Cool. Yeah. I like how you get a sense of the range by seeing when it locks on. It's pretty easy to read quickly. Yeah. But to fully answer your question, the levels will get a lot longer and a lot harder. And there's times where I died 20 times, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm just trying to figure it out, the best flow, mm -hmm. how to get the biggest combo. Did it ever oh, feel... Nice. Did it ever feel cheap or did it ever feel, or did it always feel like you were the one who kind of goofed? You know, I yelled at the game a lot. <laughs> yeah. Thinking that I was flawless, but I probably wasn't. Okay. <laughs> like right there, that'd be an instance like, no, I punched him. Yeah. yeah. Right. No, I got outplayed. That's fair. Yeah. Cool. It's. I think you can almost forgive some of those too, the fact that it nice. is so instantaneous you. that you restart. You're not looking at a loading screen. Totally. It's yeah. it's very not frustrating so far. The one thing way. I'll say is there'll be like 50 enemies in a level and you die on the last one. Oh, okay. Oh, That's yeah. where the tears start coming out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you see me punch that guy into that house? And oh, you put it? a fish yeah. on that guy. You okay. can kill people with carrots. Yep. <laughs> Shoot them up style. There's a ladder. You could just kind of jump on top of that. Of the ladder? Yeah. And just kind of hop up it. There you go. I see. Look at it. Oh. Oof. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> hey, this game's good. Yeah. It's it's very good. Yeah. Yeah. How how long did it take you to beat Reiner? C minus. Mm. Nah, I hate oh, this our, game. We're not online. Ah, oh, oh. game well, over. You would have seen that wasn't as good as me. <laughs> yeah. The game gave me an E minus once, and I appreciated e that. Wow. <laughs> It said you're not quite a failure, but you're really, really close to being one. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> My teachers would just tell me that. They wouldn't give me the letter. Yeah. You're very close to being a failure. Yeah. Watch out. <laughs> hmm. And there's player choice I'm seeing. Yes. I'm choosing to talk. Classic Leo. <laughs> 
That's with my career. <laughs> I've chosen to talk. <laughs> Any horse? Is this set in the My Little Pony universe? Uh-oh. <laughs> the ultimate brony. <laughs> so one way they could make this game cooler. If you were a brony killing machine. A brony who was a killing machine. Yeah. I'll Latin, be clear. Yeah. Let me be clear. So I believe they brought in someone from Guac the Guacamelee team to help with the writing of the characters and the character design. Okay. Oh. Meme expert. Lead meme consultant yeah. for Guacamelee. <laughs> Wow, we need to stretch this video out, guys, <laughs> so I can keep playing this. Well, I, yeah, I wanted to see it start cooking a little bit, and it yeah. should. Can you kill someone with that outhouse? No. Oh, Go. No. Mm. I can push it around. I think you could break it. With the, yeah. And then oh, it turns and then, oh, the that's how they work. Interesting. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take this for later. Is it sounded like it was alive. Yeah, yeah. right? <laughs> Damn wall raccoons. They're like uh, Minox from Star Wars. Hmm. I had the feeling so I needed the sword dash across, but I wanted yeah, to Yeah, so you can raccoon. do a jump dash. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Is there any kind of dodge mechanic? Or it's all about just moving, just positioning moving. yourself, yeah. right? That's cool. It feels good. And they really thought about item placement. Yeah. Like the, you know, there was a lot of testing that went into this to get the levels just, just right oh, for yeah. combo runs. You know, for what I mean? sure, yeah. It definitely set up like you're doing a, a line skateboarding style. There Ooh, you get to double, in one. yeah. Nice little blood smears. Oh, that guy sucks. I, <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna try and line him up, but that was a little, little cocky. Yeah, it's funny to see how people react. Like under panic situations, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like how they, they do things. Yeah. A lot of times I'd just freeze up. Like I'd be next <laughs> yeah. to him, like, ah. <laughs> Reiner throws the controller. That almost oh. happened at one point. So Accidentally. What uh, what systems is this on? Uh, PC and PS4. PlayStation 4. We're on PS4 right now. This is PS4 Pro. Obviously, I don't think there's a big difference between the standard and this. Yeah. yeah. I couldn't speak to that though. For sure. But let me just find out for sure. I was gonna say oh, this switch as well. I was gonna say this Great. looks like a switch game to me through and through. Born for switch. What are you saying? Yeah. <laughs> say I like I like my indies on my switch. Looks very top down. Yeah. And the music? Great. Great. The trees look really nice. Very unique visual style oh, too, which I appreciate. That was risky. I love that ladder vault. Oh, no, he sucks! He sucks so bad! You gotta just like memorize where those guys are and be so ready for him. Any tears yet, Leo? Yeah. I've been crying this whole time. He has not blinked, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> this feels like I should throw that. In my opinion. So I'll look around th for things to throw. Obviously, you don't know the items yet. You're getting to know them. But throwing is very handy. You won't get that guy. the yes, big nice. combos. Nice, Leo. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, the throwables seem really just fun to use. Yeah. And you were saying before we started recording, right? This is based on a true story? Yes, it is. Very cool. Your life, you said? <laughs> uh, my uncle. Uh, yeah. Oh, wow. Not quite. Called him life. Uncle Wolf. Very neat. Very neat. They are very unaware of me. That was a stun that didn't outright kill him. So okay, hey, if you throw hay at him, mm. those thing lighter cogs there. Oh, you could spin. You'll eventually get like a Captain America shield that you can throw at an enemy and then catch it in the air and then throw it again. Oh wow, cool. Oh Jane. <laughs> oh here you go. Here's the cogs. That's good. So they kind of bounce around. Oh yeah, I, I could be really fast on catching that, huh? I saw it get well, highlighted. Well, you could throw it up second. there. Up where? You see those enemies up there? Can I reach him? Let's see. No. <laughs> <laughs> you could use that ore and bounce yeah. up there and then whack him. That's good. Oh, <laughs> I was on something there for a second. <laughs> I'm going to say this is the first really tough level. Okay. Like where it's really kind of showing mm -hmm. how it can be tricky. So you're challenging me. Do you start every nice. life with the combo meter still going? No. 
Okay. Oh, I got it. So this might good. be an instance where you might with... want to throw those across the gap. Yeah. Yeah, then... I'm just really trying to catch it after I throw it. There we go. There you go. Just to prove I can. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Love this aura. There you go. Oh, that guy oh. sucks. <laughs> Careful. There we go. There oh, we go. Oh, nice. There we go. Cooking with gasoline now. Over this way and down there, you're going to want to... There you go. I am indeed. No! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Come and get me. What? No! What? Oh, you did it, did but the, fell. <laughs> did it launch me into the air? Oh. The chain? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Just saying. Let me be. <laughs> Did you yell Cliffy B? <laughs> <laughs> Leave me be, which is what the doctor misheard Cliffy B's parents say. I don't know if there's like some the traumatic name. thing where you just yell Cliffy B under certain circumstances. Yeah, I in just your life. learned something about myself there. I think. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops! Ah! <laughs> I thought that would have a little more give. Okay. I am motivated. Okay. <laughs> So it's like a light tap will do a little thing. But then you can hold it? Yeah. No. Oh, I'm flying. I see what's going on. <laughs> That's cool. I love that one. I don't know how many times I did that. I probably died on this one 10 times. Yeah. Me too. <laughs> but it feels so good. Kind of that Dark Soulsy thing, or uh, uh, I guess maybe more Super Meat Boy. <laughs> yeah. Of getting through a level. For sure. I really love the range on that ore. And there's something over there, too, I think you can grab. Is that a cool secret? Oh. oh. You got a gun. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. You had one. Yeah. <laughs> I don't care for that. So the gun is like throwing one of those vases, right? Right. So you get two shots. You're going to want to aim. There you go. You see the little green uh, targeting reticle that appears on enemies yeah uh, that base melee the killer about it is that it's such a long cooldown that's as fast as i can do it yeah. yep. and that's why the timing is so difficult mm. and why i feel so cool when you do it we should point out leo did beat the level <laughs> he did <laughs> technically <laughs> he, fell, it, he fell into acid yeah and i know that when i beat it for real then the video's over and i don't want that yeah, yeah. that's well. why i'm choosing to have all this stuff happen to me God, the screen guys. And there's other ones that are way worse, obviously. There's a guy that shoots crows at you. Uh huh. So if you throw, like Leo just threw that cog, it might hit the crow he just shot at you. And then all of a sudden you have nothing and he's just standing there shooting more crows at you. Hmm, right. Nice. Way to go back and get that. Thank you. Tactics. All right, he's got it. That dash is really good. I would often do that into the acid. Uh, yep. Because it's very fast. Oh, I thought I missed that. Yeah. <laughs> now, obviously, different kills for each. I was going to say, I feel like that that's great for like experimenting with the weapons, too. Because I feel like every is it every um, kill gives you a different like ending animation. You want to kill all these guys. I do? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I was taking all my self-control and not do it. I know I have no weapon. That's fine. I'll turn them to blood. This. Yeah, just a little <laughs> cool down for you. <laughs> I don't know about this. <laughs> they say the game's violent. I haven't seen it yet. It looks beautiful. The you know, there's some ores up there you could just grab. Oh, that's what I should do. They're worshiping them. <gasps> Bosses? Yeah. Bosses are handled a little different way than the standard levels. I won't ruin the surprises for you, but... Hmm. Are we going to see one soon? Mm. If we kept playing for another 20 minutes... Wow, a B. A B. Yeah. Oh, look, you did something I didn't Guest do. Guest one does it again. <laughs> <laughs> so do you think we should stop there, Reiner, and preserve some surprises, or show a little bit more? 
I think you should just start playing one more level. I would like yeah. to. And obviously, again, this is optional. You could talk or sleep and just start going. I'm sleeping. Yeah. I'm not interested in that boar <laughs> <laughs> that got floated, floated in. in. What a boar, yeah. right? <laughs> Look what eh, happened eh, to him. Eh, eh. It's on the fire. Oh, it's sad. <laughs> and there's the Why hats. was the boar necessary? <laughs> Attach a letter to some balloons, I feel Ballast like. Ballast for the balloons. You should be able to move. No. Okay. Yeah, so cool. you can replay it, and then that's where the different collectible things are. Was the bear hat, was that another, like... Yeah, he could go put that cosmetic, on and have yeah. a different... And it, it might just be endgame where they give you the bonuses. Like, you get a double oh. jump. Like, stuff like that. Interesting. Hmm. I chose to preserve that for <laughs> players. This level's broken. <laughs> <laughs> Did anyone test this? Yeah, come on. So what did you learn there, Leo? Th projectiles are going to bounce right off that guy. Very good. Thank you. That's my boy, Leo. Oh, the last thing he ever learned. Oh, <laughs> he ended up dead. That's fine. <laughs> oh, go over the spike. So. With the barrel? Yeah. Mm. It'll crush the spikes. Well, but you can just go over that roof right there. Yeah. And I can come back. Clear choice. That's cool. I cannot believe you just Yeah, that. I thought he was going to land on the spikes he didn't clear. Clenched up my butt a little bit right there. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I do like. Oh, that guy sucks. Yep. Oh. Really sucks. <laughs> it is a matter of like learning where those guys are. Yeah. It is really hard to react fast enough. All right. But my full reviews on the site. I can't say a score yet. I'm still working on it. Yeah. But I'll say this much. It's a very good game. Yeah. Yeah. It's good fun. One of your one of your favorites of the year so far? Boy. Yeah, I, I would say so. Just nothing against this game, but it's been kind of a slow year. So, yeah. Yeah. The other one I played, I guess, that I loved was Children of Morta, and that was from last, last year. Last year, yeah. We can at least say this is the only game that didn't get delayed this year. <laughs> it actually came out. It's the only new video game. That's Ever. right. Yeah. So you may as well buy it. Kind of limited. And jump on that and nice. Oh, nice. Twelve. Look at his combo meter. Watch me go. No. Oh. <laughs> bad guys. They're really bad. Oh, they're really bad. Leo. <laughs> All right. Thanks for letting me play this. <laughs> I'm guessing I won't be getting my PlayStation back tonight. No, definitely not. I'm guest one now. All right. You think we had enough? Leo. <laughs> sure. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for playing. Ryan, thanks for showing this. You off. bet. And thanks for watching, everybody. Bye. Ha ha ha. What a fantastic episode of New Gameplay today. Come back every week for fun, informational looks at new releases and early previews of unreleased games. Ha ha ha. Stay subscribed, and I guarantee there will be an episode about Cyberpunk 2077 at some point down the line.